makeup face. How you doing today? Today is Saturday. I'm in the grocery store. The regular icing. <laughs> Don't try nothing new now. I'm used to the one and one and this shit. That was my outfit today. I don't ever show y'all my outfit. I gotta start showing y'all my. I gotta start showing y'all my outfit because I'm gonna do a closet, uh, a try on on the stuff that I'm gonna have left after I throw away everything. But you still can't see this T-shirt I have on. Uh, you can't see it. It's like a little angry. I have a black pants. Keep it up. Here on my t-shirt, my black jacket, it has zippers on it. It has zippers here. I have four zipper pockets. I love this jacket. Put everything in your pocket. And I have a t-shirt with a young lady in red lip shades and braids in her hair. A black pants. And it's like a soft material. Comfortable. And they flares with my black, you know, my black um, purse around my uh, crossbody. Yeah, let me start showing you guys a big girl's outfit. Yeah, we dressed too. I got on my comfortable camp um, sock titty shoes. Yeah. Oh, it's the shirt you see up close. Yeah. This is what was picked up so far, because I might not do no grocery haul when we get home, because I'm going to go ahead and do it now. I I'm feel like I'll be forgetting when I get home to do that grocery haul. I don't buy nothing but Sara Leaf when it comes to the sliced bread. But the buns and stuff, I'm okay with using other brands. I got donuts, a gallon of milk, which I don't drink milk. That's, I don't know why the kids would not try almond milk, but that's what they drink. Got a uh, turkey kielbasa, shrimp, fried shrimp, like Kroger's. We at Kroger's, guys. Uh, buttery shrimp. And we got another kind here. It's the popcorn crunchy wow caught. We got hamburger patties, corn, snacks, no little snack cakes, buns, honey buns, oatmeal pies, zebra cakes, um, bacon, the original bacon. Yeah. Um, this is Johnson Bill sausage bacon. Have you guys ever tasted this? And it's on sale, so I guess people's not buying it, so we're gonna try it. You got my Tennessee Pride. Y'all know I don't mess with nothing but Tennessee Pride patties. Now the kids, they may eat something else, but not me. I'm just, I don't know. I like what I like. I'm at this age that I like what I like. I got one rose for eight, 73, nice size. And then I got another one for 12, 48. If they on sale, the original price is like 19. And the one for eight, the original price was like 13. And then I got the double pack of Johnsonville broads. Margaret's cooking Johnsonville broads, Johnsonville broads, Johnsonville broads. The whole block gonna be running for those. <laughs> I know y'all know the commercials. I know y'all know that commercial. <laughs> and then we got uh, sodas was four for 13. A bottles of 16 ounce, 16.4 ounce, I mean 9 ounce, 16.9 ounce. We got Orange Crush. Uh, we got Minute Maid Fruit Punch. We got Minute Maid Lemonade. And we got Sprites. Okay, what else we got over here? We got Orange Juice. We got uh, Tilapia 2 Packs. A tilapia. They was four ninety nine each. We got sour cream here, 
and I think I got it all. Oh, no, I didn't get it all. She just threw two more two uh, pastries in here. These are so good, so good. Potatoes, ground beef, got carrots in there, onions, and I bake them and I put cheese. I put cheese on them, or you can put gravy on them. Because if you go to the shop, because we have the original pastry shop here, and you uh, go buy it from the company itself, the restaurant itself. And you can get gravy, you can get the apple turnovers. I like to really just buy them from the uh, restaurant, but they got them in the stores. They also got them in the stores here. That business been here for years. Okay, I added more to the cart. Well, we added more to the cart. I got Eggos, butter, waffles, um, and got three Jack pizzas. They're the same. They don't eat nothing but pepperoni. Yes, here I come. Oh, hi guys, I'm home. I put up the groceries. That's why I showed you guys the things while I was in the store because I knew I was going to be too lazy to start the camera. Sometime I forget, so. This is what I'm cooking today. I'm cooking potatoes, jiffy, cornbread, roast, and a and I'm going to cook some type of vegetables. Fried corn. Oh. Hi, guys. Today, I'm going, I'm boiling a roast. And I'm adding potatoes to it. I was going to ask carrots, but I didn't pick up any. So, I'm going to uh, boil this uh, roast. And here's what I got here. You know, I got two roasts, actually. I need to cut up some potatoes. I should have them already cut up. It's not a lot going on on the stove today. The seasons I'm using is here. Okay, these are the seasonings that I added. I add garlic powder. I add more pepper. More onion powder. More seasoned salt. And I'm going to let all this boil. Again. She's catching me doing this and cleaning my potatoes. I don't know. The camera keeps jumping on. I don't know why. Okay, I got the two cups. Measuring cup, and I have the two packs of uh, gravy, brown gravy, beef gravy. Wait, brown gravy, yes, the beef gravy. And I got two packs of those. And I'm going to mix them. I have some water. I'll add one pack of brown gravy. You can get any kind you like. Or cheese. Oh, I'm gonna take it and I mix it. But you know it takes a full cup for this gravy, so I'm just gonna mix it for now. Cut this meat. Try to cut this meat while it's in the pot. Yeah, cut the meat while it's in the pot. I like to use the dishes that's already in the sink because I feel like I'm washing some of them, getting them out the way, you know. It's the big knife. The big knife that go. Yeah, go. It's a big knife. Don't y'all know this camera keep cutting off on y'all? Again, over here while I'm cutting this roast. I'm going to try this again. Now. Yep, we'll try this again. Oh, I like these. I don't, I'm sorry, guys. I just like to use these. I'm so happy with these. It's, it don't make sense. You probably like, whoa, they do different everything. Yes, I'm so happy with these. I'm so overjoyed with the simplest thing. Don't take much for me, y'all. I keep telling y'all. Don't take much to sparkle my 
that touched my heart. <laughs> and it's not even the best thing. I like to sell that. I don't mind these things I can use. You know, a lot of people want things. Okay, guys, remember I told you guys? No storage. I have to go in. Get rid of some clips that I've already used already. So now I'm making the cornbread in the same bowl that the butter, I mean the butter was in, the potatoes was in, and I'm making my butter corn. And I have some homemade macaroni and cheese that was made yesterday that I'm going to warm up also. That wasn't completely uh, on the can from the cornbread. Second day right here. Right in front of you guys. Because the oven is right here too. So, And I'm going to show you the potatoes in the roast. I haven't added the gravy yet. Because I'm showing you guys how to make a simple roast. Quick cook. Simple roast. On top of the stove. I had to wait on putting gravy in the roast. I turned the roast off. Yeah, my roast could have been done, y'all. It literally could have been done. But I said I don't start it. It's just cooking this roast. And it's how to cook a simple roast and potatoes. You don't have all the other vegetables that you see everybody else putting in there, roasting potatoes. You don't need it. I'm going to let you know that. I'm, I'm showing you that now. You don't need no more potatoes. This is a full course meal. You go spread the cornbread on in. To a little oil that's in the pan. You just put a dab of oil in the oven. Oh, I like I did on Easter. Because I'm in the kitchen. Okay, guys. I want to you guys give uh, the um roast. Here's the roast. It's Here's the roast is cooking. Okay, I just stirred the uh gravy. The pack of gravy, one cup of water, and I'm gonna add it. Because I know you make my own homemade gravy. I normally make my own, I'm sorry, I just need the camera everywhere. I normally make my own homemade gravy with flour, seasoned flour, but I don't have any flour in it. And I don't understand. That's something I never run out of is flour. Because I normally will have that flour. I check the cabinets before I go back to the grocery store. I think I go like every week. I need to start packing up on things better than what I'm doing. Okay, let me turn this roast back up. It was turned down. Okay, now it's cooking. And I'm thinking about adding another pack of gravy with less of water. Yeah, hold. Let's turn Sit this back down. Yeah, I think I'm going to add some more gravy. I literally want this to cook in gravy. You know, great brown gravy has a seasoning already to it. And I season. Look what it's doing. Look how it's cooking. Jeez, look, look at that. Watch that gravy got in there. Ooh. Look at here, look at here. Look at here, we gotta let the gravy cook on in. Look at here, look at here. Look at here. I think, uh, I may not need the other pack once it cooks itself. Yeah. I may not need the other pack. This is potatoes and rolls. Well, I got two rolls in here. I still want to cook like my mama. I can give it to you if I want to. 
Oh, God, it's tired. I'm tired of holding this phone like this. <laughs> I need my tripod. I am so hot. I gotta throw this stuff away on the cabinet. I am so hot, y'all. Oven oh, on, cooking the cornbread. I'm gonna stay in the kitchen because I got the window up, though. I'm gonna stay in the kitchen because I'm not trying to burn nothing. Or oh, yeah, guys, it's done. Potatoes and all. Popping on my finger when I'm staring it. I had to lick it off and it was good as hell. I ain't even gonna lie. That burn was worth it. <laughs> Let it cook on low. But right now, mine just started off and it's just cooking on the heat from the eye. Put that cornbread in that oven. Jiffy. <laughs> Put that in the oven. And if you ain't got a milk for your cornbread, do it with water. You do know water makes cornbread too, right? You're going to have a good meal. Yes, you will. It is not a problem. It's not hard at all to cook this roast. Put a roast on. You don't have to cook two. You can cook one. Add that cup of brown gravy. And you got your full course meal. This camera keep cutting off on me. To y'all, this, this um, camera don't cut off on me. Y'all about, i say 10 or 15 times. This is how much I want to get this meal done for you guys. How to make a simple homemade uh, roast. Yeah, this is what this is. My way. <laughs> My way or the highway. <laughs> yep, so you make this simple roast, y'all. Mm, mm, mm. Don't it look good. Yes, it do. Hey, yeah. Okay, let's go ahead and put the top on it. The spoon over there. Got the top on it now. I'm just gonna sit there. Wash the stove off. Now I'm waiting on this cornbread. I'm gonna make my plate. I'm gonna make my plate and I'm gonna show it to y'all. Let y'all see how good that looks and how good it's I'm gonna tell you how good it tastes because I know it tastes good. It already popped on my finger, burnt the hell out of me, but it was good. It was worth it. <laughs> that lick was worth it. <laughs> oh, for real, for real, that lick was worth it. See, look, 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 look at here. Look at here. Keep my eye on that cornbread this time. I ain't playing. I'm not burning my cornbread. I burnt the bottom of it on uh, Easter. Want to do it again? Ah, uh ah. -uh. Okay, let you see how good the cornbread looks and let you know I didn't burn it. And I'll show you my plate. Let me check the time and see, guys. Okay, 7.18 now. Took me, what, two hours? Yeah. Two-hour meal. You want that roast tender? You want it good? You, yeah. Huh. Yeah. Yeah, because if you put it, if I would have put it in this, uh, my new, uh, slow cooker, got from J.C. Penney's, <laughs> thanks to my niece, my lovely niece, <laughs> Leisha, <laughs> I got a brand new slow cooker, y'all, mm-hmm, I cooked the, I cooked my first roast in there, I think I made a video, you guys probably can go check that video out, I think I made a video of making a roast, cooking in my, a uh, slow cooker for the first time, and it was a roast. So that roast take that that slow cooker. When they say slow, hell yeah, that's slow. Take too long for me. But like I said, you put it on top of the eye, it cooks real fast. But I use it. But but for right now, I I was hungry. Okay, so I used the eye. So my stuff got done in two hours. Uh, with the uh, slow cooker, I'll say it took that roast probably about five hours because I stopped it at it was set for four hours. Cause it was going, I was going by the pounds. Sometimes you can't go by the pounds, and so I end up turning it on for another hour, but turning it up high. I had it on slow cook, and I had it on low. But I should have had it probably in between, and it would have cooked faster. But you know, that's what a slow cooker. That's why it's called slow cooker. You can put it on in the morning, be done by evening. But not me. I put it on the eye, okay? Get done in two hours. Less than that, it depends. It depends. I had two in one in a pot in one pot, so sorry why it took a little longer, but yeah guys. Stay tuned for the plate and that beautiful cornbread.
Don't play with crunch? it. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Check um, that cornbread out. It's this thing yeah, called my motherfucking yeast. Get out my motherfucking yeast. Oh, that's good. You're not the one that I'm eating! Ignore them. They're back there talking about dates and shit. It's the roast cornbread corn and margarine cheese. Good morning! Good morning! I'm gonna make a babe. How you guys doing today? We're on our way. Go pay a couple bills and uh, no, go pay a bill. And we're trying to go out here and do some work. Mm -hmm. Then I got a meeting at 1 30. I'm done. Yeah, so I got a meeting at 1 30, so I'm be back at home. Guess what? It's snowing here. Look at what I got on. Mm-hmm. It has its own. It's snowing. It's snowing. Look at the mirror. I can see it right now. It's snowing. Like I said, I'm going to do a, a, a movie night. We'll be sitting and watch the movie. Chicken for lunch and come get you a lunch, mashed potatoes, margarine and cheese. I think I showed all the uh breakfast salad. Yeah. I think I showed all of them. These are burgers and corn dogs. The breakfast I think is open. <laughs> they don't have signs for a lot of them. I think all the sandwiches right here. All the breakfast sandwiches. I can always show that. We got all types of water. You know, it's all it's a quickie mark. So drink I want to try guys. I wanna do the uh feet trash bag. Zero sugars. Those are a good hydrating drink. <laughs> Look, these are, these are lunches too, guys. What? Okay. That's not for six rounds, twenty-one dollars. But we're going to Costco, Costco, Costco. They drop at ten o'clock, and drop means they put in orders at ten o'clock. So. That's what dropped me. Sound Club. This one is still here. It's only eight items for twenty-two dollars. But look how far you gotta go. Almost thirty miles for twenty-two dollars. So. What we gonna do? Oh, she's gonna wait on Costco drop. The Costco drop me fifty and more. So you see why we're working on Costco. This is for my money. When we get up here, we see familiar um, workers. <laughs> I see old boy too. He, he been back up here in the little. Cause he probably got truck. a new location he be at. That's the why. See, a lot of people find new locations and other things. I think it's for me to come too. Where's she at? She right here. This her? Mm-hmm. I can't get next to her, but I'm getting against it. Now we at Costco, so we wait on the Okay, drop. watch your thing. I am, I'm doing it now. Why I just do that yeah. to my car? Like Somebody finally took the $22 for Sam Club. They probably took it away. I'm not doing that with the lemon one. I ain't never had this one before. Oh yeah guys, I'm trying this um I 
had the other one. What you get? This new drink. Which one you get? I got the um, peach and raspberry. It sounds so delicious. Zero sugars, hydrating lemon water. Oh, but it's made in lemon water. Let's get your label on us. Regardless of the flavor, it's peach and raspberry. It said lemon perfect. Oh, this probably is a good drink because lemon water is good for you, anyways. Okay, guys, we're gonna try this. Hey! Oh, guys, the young lady that. just got one for $78. You see how they didn't show me that, though? But they don't but show. they didn't show me that, though. They is tricky out here. They show only certain people what they want to show. Yes, it's, it's tricky, y'all. It's 70 here. But that's not fair to us that still be out here working like everybody else. And we just starting, like, get trying to build ours up, though. That's not fair to us, though. Well, that's when you need to petition and get 150 people to sign on and Send it to them. Oh, yeah. Instacart. We know how to do it. Okay, guys. I'm trying to try this water. I wasn't even able to open this water. Them orders are just dropping, dropping, dropping. It's six of me here now. And them orders are just dropping. They were just dropping. Man. And then a $54 one dropped in. Somebody snatched it. <laughs> This is a rat race. Now, this is what you call a rat race right here. If you ain't got no high status. Like I said, guys, this peach and raspberry. I don't even really have time to taste this drink. <laughs> I got to pick this back up. Okay, $39 popped in from Costco. Uh, this is 20 miles, 40 items. She said that mud had two people. Love some water. So if she would have... This is what I mean when I be saying the drop. Is when the store open and they just start dropping them orders in. I'm gonna make a base. Today the problem is here because I had a leak in my garbage disposal and a small uh, tightening of the tub and it was the water was going down very slow in the bathroom thank you for the kitchen's done already I had to come home from out earlier, as you seen, I was out on Instacart. I had to get here because I forgot. I think maybe you call it today. I come home to the uh, repairs.
What I've used when I've been wanting to dip some cheese or something. Where is it? One cup measurement. You just feel like it can't do too much when it's just something that's working. I 
Okay. I get my personal cups. I have to buy some as well. I'm not going to wipe out my own plastic for my spoon. <laughs> Only when I feel like it. I don't feel like we already know it's going to be dry. And I know I'm not the only one who washes these out. <laughs> Outside, make some money, then go in the inside and clean it. <laughs> it's always something to do in the house. Always. Something to clean up. Especially for my closet. It's cluttered. Oof. Oof. I'm gonna lock it down and then I'm gonna do a try on what I do have left. Also do it This one sponge does it all. I want one of those uh sponge holders to do anything. And I want one of those sink. Um I think it's a this it, I like the basket too that you can put across the sink to clean your future vegetables. I would like to have one of those. Those as well. I sit now. It's the drink. I don't too much like my drinks cold, cold. Every head freeze. Oh, not a good feeling. A head freeze. No. Like I told you guys, I like to dry my dishes with paper towel. Because, hey, easy for me. Yes, it is. Okay. Another bowl is up. There's only two. Oh, I need to stir one. Saucer. Love my stoneware set. Dedicated to glass, dedicated to plates. So, very got there in me. I think you got enough room for food to go.
definitely not sure this girl. The dry it all and it's still dry. The straight the towel still dry. Let me show y'all in there. I'm a short shirt out of sack. If you're still the credit, I'll show you. Ask me what my paper towel holder at. It just sits on the cabinet. Ask my uh, six-year-old grandson. He played with it. Oh, uh, a weapon. It's it was metal. Yeah, I got it from the Dollar Tree. It was metal. Or did I get it from the Dollar Tree? I don't know. I may have got it from the Dollar Tree. I'm not sure. It was metal. Got to hang this back up. Uh, see, look, paper towel. It's not soaked. It's still dryness. So I said I like to drive paper towel. It wastes a lot of paper towel, sure enough. But I love it. Quick and fast. My sink was, uh, this was starting to get loose to the faucet, so he tightened that up as well. This, I, I didn't have a problem with this sprayer though. It was brand new as well. Both of these are new. It's just a garbage disposal. This is my perfume cup. <laughs> This is a little one here. Grandson loved it, so I'm gonna throw it away. Just a clean gun. 
I use for my cabinets and underneath the cabinet because I definitely need to get under there. I want to change the bottom, the um, what do you call that? The not I, I don't know if you call it wallpaper or whatever to lay down on the bottom of the cabinet because the cabinet is is terrible at this moment. It needs to be repaired. I want to repair that. This I use this for the kitchen. I got one in the kitchen and I got one in the bathroom. And it goes under the sink. This is the one that was in the restroom because the one is for the kitchen is under here. Hmm. I have one for the kitchen as well. I smell old under there. Find myself trying to clean under there, but it still smell old. Smells old. So I definitely want to do a DIY for that. Have you guys ever tried this? These sprays? This smells so good. This one right here is Gardenia uh, Short Scent. It smells so good. I don't know where my daughter to get this from. I don't know if she got this from Target or where. Yeah, this smells so good. I don't know where she got it from. But it does smell good. Girl, it's down in the kitchen. Both of them go back in the bathroom, actually. They both can. Okay, guys. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, my makeup babes. How you guys doing? I like the movies. <laughs> Like five minutes. Talk to you guys when I leave the movies. Alisa out of here. Ending of the movie, guys. It was a great movie, guys. It was worth it. Me yeah, as an adult, it was worth it. Oh. And here's my grandson. Tell him you like it, Amy. It was good. He said it was good. What you no, come and see? You was scared? You was scared? Yeah, I'm from the fish. Oh, that fish was dead. Oh, the fish? Look, my chair, me and my chair, I'm going to have it out. They keep making me go the way I want to go. Guys, I got a refill on my large. My grandson got a refill. He refilled his icy. I got to refill my drink. My daughter. Okay, I refilled my uh, popcorn, and my grandson refilled his. We had the large combo. And it's a bar here, guys. See? Large popcorn. The popcorn's so good. See, here got a bar over here. That's the bar. I'm waiting on them to come out. They haven't came out yet. I don't mess the back of my hair up. Well, my... You know, it's mine. I paid for it. That gets to claim it. <laughs> Sitting in the recliner chairs. Where are you at? You left me holding two popcorns. You left me holding two popcorns. Mm-hmm. This popcorn is good at the movie. I don't know what they doing. I guess they looking at, um... Previews, I don't know, but the movie's over. Mario is over. I oh, wish you come out because I want to stop at Dollar Tree. Mm hmm. The Dollar Tree that's over here. I want to get some shower curtains. And, um, I want to get some shower curtains at the Dollar Tree. Because I, what I do, I get the shower curtain. I find the color in the shower curtain. And I get another shower curtain with that color in it. If I can find it solid. And I hang it up to the window. Mm-hmm. So I'm just having a blind up there. I hang it up to the window. Y'all better take that. What I'm talking about. DIY. Okay, like that. Wow, they didn't pay my rent. My phone 
I'm dead. I'm charged when I get in the car. Where my neck at? Why they got me carrying both of the big large popcorns? <laughs> Better hope these fingers don't drop one of them. Cause I'm kidding mine. <laughs> It is cold out here now. Woo! It don't got chilly, y'all. It was chilly when we came, but you know at night that weather really drops. That movie literally went off within an hour. It was good. I like that it was a storyline and it was action all the way through Mario. So if you haven't brought the kids, you need to bring them. They would love it. I mean, it's not a horribly long movie. Aiden, come over here. Go ahead, baby. But, yeah. I'll catch you later, guys. You got this here? Yeah. We got sleep in my house. You gonna drop it? Okay. Let me get in, guys. I'm talking about him wasting his part. Make sure I don't waste mine. Oh, Ain't behind you, Monique. Oh, we're in. Oh. I don't know if we're going to catch. Dollar Tree is probably closed. It's 9 o'clock. Dollar Tree closed. It's 9 o'clock. Oh, yeah. oh. We'll do it tomorrow. Two hours? They lied. They, they, see two hours, though. they lied. Because we did get in here at 7, but it's probably, probably about an hour or something. 30. It's probably about an hour or something. Okay, guys. See you when I get home. I need I'm cooking fried fish and rice and string beans. Let me show you guys. There's the fish frying, string beans, and water boiling for rice. This is the seasoning that I'm using. And I also added lobster mama for a kick. And I added pepper. I'm not just cooking for myself, so I get a cup. It's a full two cups. <laughs> and I get like one third. That was a full two cups, so this is this measures two cups. This right here. Oh Turn this eye off on the rice. Let's stir it. Because you know, many rice will let it sit and the fish cooking on its own. Where's the pot? I'm going to tap it to my pot. 
What did I send you? Oh, I got so much black and silver stuff on this <laughs> card over here. I just, come on, just forgive me, guys. Oh, I got so much sitting on uh, this black and silver. I couldn't tell if the top was sitting on there or not. Ain't that something? One more time. Check it out. Yeah, it's going to get ready to come out in a split sec, and we're going to put the other four in here. It's four in here, and then we're going to take the four out and put it in here. And then we're going to take this four and put it in the skillet. I, I turned on the out. I gradually on the fish, I let the grease get hot. I turn down the eye on the grease, I let it cool just a, down a little, then I add the fish because if you put that in there and that grease is too hot, that fish gonna burn right away. Because fish, it doesn't take long to cook. It's gonna burn right away. Okay, the string beans. Let's stir these. Okay, got butter in these already. Okay, we know it's time for you to come out. We know you're floating and you want to pop. We already know. We already know what time it is, right? Oh, look how good it looks. Well, let me show you. I'll show you guys the last piece. I need to get it out this piece. And I need to start putting the other fish in because you can't wait. Because that grease will burn. So, I'll show it to you guys once I get the fish in, okay? Because you know, once you batter fish, the batter is in the skillet. Oh, there's only three left in here. And that batter is going to continue to cook. That fell off the fish. My granddaughter's cooking baked chicken. Okay, and I disposed of this batter. That's left, I just told of it. Hot, it's hot. Ooh, so the can't fit in the sink right away, so. I have to constantly do this to make sure there's no grease on the refrigerator. There's no grease pot. Grease goes wherever it wants to go. Okay, guys, here's the fish. See how good it looks? It's crispy, crunchy, and it has a kick. That slapped your mama, it's Cajun. Yes. And that's what I eat my fish with, guys. I'm gonna give y'all a couple minutes to guess what I dip my fish in to eat it. We'll give you a couple minutes to guess. Go ahead, guess. Can we get the butter? The rice? Oh, battery running down. I hope we can get some butter. It is Thursday night. I don't want to use that to break that up. Use my hand actually, because I'm just going to stick that in there and break another one fourth. Stick it in there. There we go. Let's have a better refrigerator. I don't like to use the butter that's on my um in my butter dish because I like to use that for bread, toast and stuff like that. I don't like to just mess with my soft my soft butter unless I'm spreading it on bread or oh and this is the bread I love. I love this bread guys. From um 
cheese factory. I think I showed you guys this bread in a video once before. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to put in one. I'm not going to put it in anything. I'm just going to lay it on the rack of the oven. It's clean. Oh, that heat is hot. I'm going to lay it on the rack on the oven. Hey, little boy. Get out them hot clothes. Yo, hoodie got on the hoodie. It is hot in this kitchen. And you got on the hoodie. Jogging pants or skinny yeah. shoes, and you're in the house for the night. It's hot because you're cooking. Yeah, baby. So I got the no here. Rice. And yes, I do add sugar to my rice. Sometimes I like, eat it with seasoned salt and pepper. I have to have that taste, you know? When I have that taste for it, I just season it with. Like if I'm using gravy or something, I'm fine. Um. Still being put down too well. Okay. Check back in on the fish, see what it can flip. I try to remember the first piece I put in, so that will be the first piece I flip. And I think it's this one. So. And it's not trying to flip it though. I'm going to lay it on there. I'm going to lay the other one on the stove because it's not hot. Okay, once that butter melts, I'm going to... And it finished, the water still finished absorbing out of the rice on to fluff the rice. I'm going to uh, stir it up. So you want to check the chicken? Oh, let me get I need an eye. I have a piece of bread. Let me get that out of there. You need a what now? I need an eye. I'm making fresh with food. Hmm? That's rice with food, isn't it? I guess she cooks her whole meal herself. So I know you better not have no rice in there. Because you got a chance to take some of that out before you start cooking. I could work. Okay. So, let me say. Um, no, no. Y'all, I said make sure you get some of the rice out of the pot. Not throw it in the garbage, little <laughs> girl. Excuse me. <laughs> Put it back in the pot, <laughs> in the box, Marie. This girl wouldn't empty the rice in the garbage. This is what I be saying that comments sense don't be cooking in with her and her brother. I don't get it. Why would you think that I'm saying, come on, where's the rice, girl? It hasn't even been touched. <laughs> she just got it sitting in the pot ready to put water in it and put it on the stove. Keep you on your, your shooting. Yeah, I put it over there. Just a sec. Then my chicken gonna burn. Check this on the mix. On the mix. Okay, guys, here's my plate. Every time I put concealer on, it completely my changes fish, my face. No matter how so the way it is, it looks full face on me. My rose from uh, and Cheese like Factory. <laughs> In the street, yes. This is really what your girl eating, eating today. Hi, guys. I'm in Dollar Tree. Oh, it's so nice in here, guys. Like the little personal coffee cups to get, too. Oh, look at these cups. These are nice. Isn't it? I can show y'all. It's all the hula hoop. I want to throw a hula hoop party this summer. Yeah, they got everything you need. Look at the drink cups. Look at these. I would definitely want these for the party. You can either get these kind. Coffee lovers and the hula hoop skirts. Oh, look. Oh, you know how I know these hula hoop skirts don't fit everybody. I would take more than one and put it together so I would get the green. <laughs> I have to have a green. We'll make it work to fit everybody's waistline. Sure, we'll. Oh, look at these. Oh, yeah, we have the hula hoop party. Oh, definitely. Look at the coat. We have the hula hoop party, y'all. They got yellow, pink. 
purple. Right yes. Oh, look at these. Look at the margarita cups. Let me. This is so nice. I'm having a hula hoop party. I'm having a hula hoop party. Oh, these are cute. Look at these. For the kids. No, the kids gonna want one of these. Look at these. Let me turn it upside right so you can see it right. Look at that. We having a hula hoop party for real, huh? Yes, we having a hula hoop party, guys. Oh, look at the little hangers for the yard. Oh, these are so cute. It's going to be so nice, this party. Shot glasses. I want to start getting this stuff now because when that time comes, look at the shot glasses, straws, plates. Mm-hmm. I did that. I like this phone because this phone pauses. You don't have to hit stop and all that. Oh, look all this. What the lights are? What is that? Did the light come on? These actually lights up, guys. Look. Does that press me? Light me up? Come on, focus. There's all the 4th of July stuff. Everybody has a 4th of July party. <laughs> can't, still can't stop. Stop your prayer and belief. All the 4th of July. You know I'm having the 4th of July gathering regardless. So It's just that hula hoop. I definitely have. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. I'm going to go that color. Look at the car. I'm going to show y'all in a minute where I'm looking at the bathroom. Tell y'all about my bathroom stuff here, too. Look at these. Look at the little hats. The little head things. Headbands. Oh, and they got 4th of July caps. Get your caps and get something to put on them. Here's the flags. I need to be getting a flag now. They got mats, placemats, garland. These are, it's a blue tablecloth set. Oh, yes, y'all can do, uh, paint the kitchen, too. I might do a video on it. Yes, I'm going to paint the kitchen. And then you know, 125 Nothing's a dollar anymore. Okay, I need to go look at it. Here's the sandals for the, the, the uh, flip-flops for the hula hoop party. Yes, guys. He's going to be ready. Why did he want a hula hoop? I don't know my grandson. He just wanted everything. No, nah, that ain't what I would buy. That's what you would buy. So. Okay, I'm getting these two packs of nails right here. Blue and pink. I don't like those. You only get 12. Guys, look at the lashes. Okay. I'm going to try. They even got to put on. You want to do them yourself. I'm going to grab a pair, a couple pairs of these lashes. And test them out. See how good they look. Ooh. So stay tuned. Lash collection coming soon. Oh, it's thundering outside, y'all. Yeah, hurry and get out of here and beat this weather. Okay, I need that to, to uh, just get my stuff. They got gel now. Hey, guys. Uh, Watch my surroundings. I lock the door. You know when I shop, I watch. I like to watch my surroundings. I look around. Yeah, it seems pretty safe. Go ahead and put the stuff in the car. Guys, nice. can't be too safe out here. A bag just threw out of my car. Just threw out the truck. And it wasn't even sitting on top of nothing. It's very. Windy out the I don't know if you guys can see me or not, but yeah. 
go ahead and put these bags in. Oh, I might do a separate haul uh, video. Oh. I don't know if I'm going to put this on the weekly vlog or not. Yeah. Take the car back in. And lock the car down. I want to have a surprise when I get in the car. There we go. Put your alarm. I'm not surprised getting in the car. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, Oh, thank you. Appreciate it. Ah, oh, you have a nice day, too. Good. It's getting so cold out here, guys. It's just that. It. Okay, guys, it's so cold. I'm in the car now. We missed it. <laughs> that's a good thing. That's for anybody. That's a good thing. Missing the way. I need my tripod. My arm getting tired holding this. So I'll see you guys when I get home. I'm gonna make up, babes. Today is Friday. And I was just looking over my stuff because I really want to do my room. Uh, throw away a lot of this clutter and clothes that I don't wear. But I don't think I'm gonna do it today. It's maybe in next week's vlog. And, um. I'm gonna do my homework. Okay, go get your book bag. My baby wanna do his homework. And uh, I wanna show you guys what I discovered I had. And I knew I had it. I'm going to show you guys what all it does. Wait, I turned it off. Sorry, it got so many buttons. Look, it has so many buttons on it. <laughs> yes. Oh, that's yellow. Look at the rainbow. I want to record, do some TikToks or something, or some YouTube uh, shorts. Yeah, look at that. I don't even think about this one. Isn't that nice? I've been having this for about a year or so. And I forget it because it's behind my... Um, TV. It was that. It was behind my TV. It is so nice. <laughs> I can do TikToks with this, right? I'm gonna try a video with it with the rainbow setting. Okay, I like it. Disco lights, hey! Boom, 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 boom. Some disco lights, come on. Boom, 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 boom. Let's go, let's go. <laughs> This thing is amazing. Look at all what it does. I mean, every color flickers like this. The disco lights. I could use this for a party. This summer, I'll be using this out in the backyard for my hula party I want to throw. Well, they like the ocean. It's purple. There you go. I'm going to use this for my hula party. Hula party. Yeah, guys, that light, I'm definitely using that for my uh, hula party. I want a hula party this summer. And if it turns out nice, I want more than one. So I can't take one. And I don't know what I'm going to do with that wig. That wig just sitting there. 
just sitting there. Looking dorky and I'll probably end up throwing it in the garbage. I might try to curl it. You know how them curls be? They have them wigs with the curl coming down, but it'd be even, it'd be like a cut, but it'd be curls hanging down. I'm going to try that. Yeah, we're going to try that one day. I'll do it with you guys. I ain't like that. I'll do it with you guys. But like I said, happy Friday is here. Thank God for blessing us all to see this day. Wake up to this beautiful day. It's so nice and sunny outside. It ain't what you call hot, but it's beautiful outside. I can still go outside with a jacket on. A nice thin jacket or just my hoodie and be fine. Or my thin black zipper jacket I had on the other day. Later that night, actually. Because it started happening that night. Well, yes, guys. This is my last video for my weekly vlog. Yes, the weekly vlog goes up to, it will be uh, up tomorrow, Saturday, around, I don't know, between 8 and 11 a.m. Because I'm going to put it up today, and I'm going to set it to upload either 8 a.m. or 11 a.m. Yes, yeah, so I'm going to do it that way. And guys, when you watch this vlog, make sure you um, share this vlog. Tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend. You know. But I'll see you guys once I find something to eat. This is what I decided to eat today. Today is Friday. And it's about... No, it is 5.30 p.m. I, when my stomach was sick, I don't want to eat nothing really heavy. So, I decided to eat breakfast. I said, go ahead and eat breakfast food. I got honey on my waffles, little butter, my eggs, my Tennessee Pride sauces. I got three of those. Grits. Yes. Grits. I'm getting ready to eat, guys. So, I'll be back with you when I'm done eating. If I don't be back, thanks for watching. Hit, give me that like if you made it to the end of this video. I know it's probably ain't big and ain't long at all. But if I don't come back, you know this is what I ate today. And I may come back later on tonight, though. Until next time. Oh, and you're new to the channel. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell. And uh, join the Mega Babes. Peace.